Alright, LIB family. Got something a little different going on today. We are going metal detecting. Here is a kind of a ride along video. Going to meet up with Blackbeard J. It's a local channel.
what to do. You know, that I I was I was planning a trip to the Pack West. You know, I was walking around the woods acting like there was Sasquatch around, but I didn't really think there was. So I was literally talking to Bubba and his and his family or whatever, whoever was there at the time. You know, not knowing until you know a bunch of you know until, until a bunch of people started pointing it out and stuff because I started filming and doing live streams. You know, I uh, and then I saw him. I saw Bubba, that was that. I'll take you guys off the uh, mount for a second so you can see. Stick around. That one's actually, that one's just rising too, but, but that one's just still raising up. You can see in the middle it kind of splits. So something big must be needing to come through. Maybe we'll get luckier. <laughs> that, would, that would be great. But even back there, look, you could see, if you go just across the water, there's just more or woods. Now, I wouldn't call it a forest by any means because the only forest we really have is um, in the Pine Barrens which is a thousand acres. Uh, a thousand acres of, of forest and uh, that's pretty much what what you would get. Like if you were to Google Long Island and, and the woods on Long Island or, or the forest or you know how much woods is in Long Island they would probably just show you that you know, because I've tried it. I was like, how do people keep finding, like, that there is no woods here? How do they keep finding that out? Like, how is that the common thread? And that's what pops up. Like, and I'm talking, like, there's a big old sailboat or something. Oh, maybe it's a, it's a tall mast, but maybe it's because it's a, 
maybe it's a fishing boat. It looked like a sailboat at first, because there's no crow nest up there, there's nothing, nothing, nothing like that. It doesn't look very commercial. I don't know, what the hell do I know? So, yeah, I was like, how is this possible? So basically, long story short, the search, his top 10 searches basically kept coming up for the pine barrens, which are not the Jersey pine barrens. I know this keeps happening, you know, it's a common, common thing too. Is, a lot of people think of the Jersey Pine Barrens right away, which cool, I get it. Like, you know, I I, I didn't realize we had Pine Barrens here on, until I was started to do the Bigfoot stuff. I really, I, I really didn't. Sorry, and I came so, so I really didn't look into like I didn't I never looked into it that much. You know what I mean? So, long story short, I, I just started to check into it because people were always like, oh, there's not enough, there's not enough roots there, there's not enough woods there. I even had this guy talking shit on this other channel a while back uh, this was like last year probably and the guy is like a complete waste he just like talks shit about other people's work you know what I mean like uh, he doesn't even like dissect it to see if it's true on like a real level or if it's a hoax or like try to break it down in a positive way he just trashes people I was like the first Bigfoot like episode he ever did too so I caught a lot of hell for it but um Long story short, it, he like showed like an hour and a half west of here. He showed a beach in the middle of summer, and the boardwalk on the beach, uh, saying it was busy there, and, and uh, there's no BFRO sightings here, and, and uh, uh, reports here, and this and that. It gives a shit, you know. Like it was just such an elementary school breakdown that like I wasn't even mad at. It. I was like I felt. I felt bad for him, and I couldn't believe he had, like, at the time he had almost, like, 50,000 viewers. Then it went up, and he went back down, which makes sense, but still, I just don't get it. Sometimes I just wonder, but long story short, um, it, it's it's obviously easy to think that there there's nowhere for a Sasquatch to be around here, and, uh, I guess that was kind of the purpose of this ride along. I just wanted to show you guys a little bit of the island. And uh, I want to start expanding the process of how we do things here. You know, that's why I got the FLIR. I, I could have I did with or without it. You know what I mean? It's that, it's, I'm sure it's going to be a lot of fun to use and stuff. But I'm not really a night guy. You know what I mean? I don't really go. I, a lot of times I go up by myself, so I don't really go out at night and stuff. You know what I mean, plus they, they, they're, a little, they're different at night. Everything's different than that. So I didn't really plan on do, doing that. But when you guys who are involved in this, that's why I say thank you, thank you, thank you. That's you, that's me, that's Sasquatch. You know, or Forest Beans, period. That's all of us. So that's a thank for everybody. It's us. It's a we thing, not a me thing. So if multiple, multiple, multiple people continue to say, like, you should get a thermal that would be great, that would be great, and it went on, I heard this for about six months now, continuously, and I put a little aside every time, every time I put a little aside, and I was able to get it, so here it is, it's here, and we're going to work with that, but that, you know, that, and, and some other stuff, like, I, I plan on expanding on a lot of things right now, we have a lot going on, there's another baby coming, our other son is very young, we have three other children, um, so, you know, it, there's a lot going on. Like, I'm uh, very, very distracted. There's, there's, there's a lot happening on the home front. So, when things settle down, which they will in the future, and, you know, I appreciate all you who are here, you know, in the beginning stages, but, you know, it's going to only grow, grow, get better and grow bigger and, and, uh, and expand, period. You know what I mean? Um, I'm starting to reach out to other people to start collaborating and doing some certain things. If you haven't seen the collaboration on the Montauk pro um, project area at Camp Hero, um, Dark Hour Paranormals came out last night. Badass. I mean, I would watch, I'm going to watch it again and I'm going to probably watch it again. It was, bet, like Brian said from Montauk is Strange, who does, has alternate footage too, it was awesome too, his footage. But, but uh, like Brian said about the HPs, he said, you know, he said, you know his shit was better than a TV show. And I was like, you're right. Like, he did better than a cable series. Um, 
All right, we got the green light, so we're out of here. Oh, that was a that was a big waste of time sitting there, but it is what it is. So we go across this bridge now, and then so so Cap Tree that I was telling you about. Uh, that's Ocean Parkway. We could get off there, and that goes that takes off down and goes along the South Shore, past a lot a lot of places, a lot of beaches and a lot of nice places and a lot a lot of nice shoreline wood. Shore, shoreline woodline yeah I guess that's what you would consider um, and then this is the exit for Cap Tree which I was telling you about which is a nice you know big side island that they do charter fishing out of and this is the last bridge over and then it's just uh, you know like I was saying if you can see I don't know but there is like woodline like on the shoreline you see what I'm saying like down in here too it's a lot of nice brush to, to hide it Alright, I gotta drive. So anyway guys, I'm gonna um oh, what's going on up here? I am gonna go drive, I'm gonna figure out figure out where the hell I gotta go to. So I'm gonna uh, text Jay and see uh make sure I get the right field. Let's see if I can get you one last nice view. There's a nice tower up here coming up. To purposes, it might have been like a water tower at one point. You see the charter boats down there? That there's one, I don't know if you can see through this gate, like this side, side of shit. What the hell are they called? I don't, don't matter. It's the Coast Guard side rail. Well, anyway, guys, uh, I really don't remember anything I said, so just a little sightseeing. Hope you all have a blessed, blessed day. Enjoy your weekend. I'll try and get out tonight if I'm not exhausted after this and get some clear footage. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Have a wonderful day.